What's up guys, I Apple Tuber here and today I have a very cool video for you guys. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to recover your lost data. So let's say you deleted an image or you deleted something by accident, you can be able to recover that and also be able to fix most of the iOS issues after jailbreak or even before jailbreak. Let's say your device has an issue, you'll be able to fix it with this amazing software that I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. And now let's go ahead and connect our device to the computer first of all. All right guys, I've gone ahead and connected my device to the computer and now let's get started guys. All right guys, so as you can see right there, I'm on the website iMyPhone D Backup. So I'll leave this link in the description for you guys to go ahead and check out. So guys, once you're here guys, as you can see it says, recover iPhone, iPad and iPod data with iMyPhone D Backup. It's pretty easy, it does recover your data using the iOS device, iTunes backup, or even iCloud backup, and also to the smart recovery, which I'm going to go ahead and show you guys all these, so don't worry about it. And also guys, as I mentioned, it also fixes a lot of iOS issues without any loss of data, which is very good as well. And it is compatible with iOS 10 and the iPhone 7, which is once again, pretty good. So the best thing about it guys, it supports both Windows and Mac. So you have both versions, nothing to worry about. And as well, you can go ahead and test it for free. That's the best thing. And so as you can see, lost ios you just connect i'm going to go ahead and show you guys everything all of these and there's a lot that you can do so let's say if you have a broken screen you lost all your data you can get it back if you if there's if there was a system crash or you if you jail if you jail broke your device and unfortunately had to delete your data or lost your data you can get it back as simple as that with all the data supported like whatsapp kick wechat viber line message and imessage as well which is very good i use all of these pretty good these were all the four methods as i mentioned and now we should be able to go ahead and start the video guys so here's the software i already got it so let me go ahead and set it up everything is ready so guys the first method which i'm going to go ahead and first of all show you is the smart recovery so let's get click on start so it will ask you how did you lose your data so let's say you lost your data by accident it, if it was a reset, jailbreak, or if your phone was damaged or lost. So for example, let's say we have lost our data by accident. So click on it. Then it will ask you guys, okay, so what have you lost? Messages, call history, contacts. It will be able to, to recover all of these. So as you can see, it's selected all. You can go ahead and unselect all. And let's say, okay, we only want to recover our, our contacts. We only want to recover our photos. We only want to recover our Safari history or even just our note. This will allow you to be able to recover all of these through the iOS device. Then you want to click on next, as simple as this, it will find your device, okay, it's the iPhone 7, click on scan, and right there guys, done. It will go ahead and find everything. All right, so that was rumor from the iOS device. Now guys, the next one is recover from your iTunes backup. So let's say you have your iTunes backup, you want to recover that, it's as simple as this, just click on start. It will ask you what have you lost, you just want to check mark what you have lost, like let's say contact, Viber, I don't know, Skype, or even WhatsApp. So let's say you have a chat or you had a phone number or something that you lost, you can even go ahead and recover that using your contacts as well. Pretty simple. And you can just go ahead and click on next, it will go ahead and recover. But remember guys, it will take time because these files are heavy files and they will take about 60 to 70 minutes to recover. So please be patient, which is recover from iCloud backup. So if you're the person who uses your iCloud just to back up and everything this is the method you want to go for so click on start once again the same procedure you click on next and I'm pretty sure yes as you can see it will ask you for your iCloud 100% safe guys just enter your Apple ID and password it will go ahead and be able to recover what you have lost to your iCloud and here's the last thing the fixed iOS system and as you can see it says that my device is connected now and it is normal because it is not stuck into recovery mode but if your device is stuck into recovery mode it will allow you to fix it and when you click on next, it will ask you, like, as you can see, black screen stuck on Apple logo, recovery mode, other, and then you should be able to identify which one is yours and it will be able to fix it for you. Take it out of recovery mode and make your device as good as it used to be. All right, guys, so that was it with today's video. I hope that you guys find this software helpful and I'm pretty sure it's gonna help a lot of you guys. Please make sure to like this video, share this video and also subscribe to the channel and also make sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. See you guys in the next video. I Apple Tuber here, signing off.